What should I even say? What do I even say in a hook video like this? Um, Welcome to uh, part two of installing the greenhouse heater. All right, this weekend we are gonna try to finish installing the heater. I don't know if we'll get it all wired up or not, but we will at least get the vent ran and get gas ran out to it and hooked up. So you have to vent these heaters. So what we have is this vent pipe, you know, and it comes out and then outside the greenhouse is the little end of it. But the vent pipe gets hot, so it can't just run through the greenhouse wall and our walls are made out of plastic film. So what we have to do is build this little frame here and there'll be one of these pieces on the inside and one on the outside. They'll sit like that. And then we'll use our wiggle wire channel. We just got this double channel. So we'll just cut this in half, but we'll use this all around the edges. And then we will basically put the wiggle wire in, cut out this section of plastic and then run the pipe through this. That way it's got this much area around it where it's not getting hot or to keep it from burning the plastic or whatever. So we got to figure out exactly where this frame needs to go to line up with the vent on the back of the heater. So we'll get that all figured out and start working on this. And then we got to run the gas line the rest of the way into the building and get that hooked up to the heater. So we'll be going on that and go from there. Okay, we got this all built for the vent pipe. So this side is all the channel for the wiggle wire. So we'll put the plastic in here and then we'll cut out this square of plastic. And then this will be on the inside of the greenhouse. This will go to the heater. Boom, just like that. And then for some reason, this kit we got came with this awesome, huge, massive gap here. So probably have to figure out how to fill that with like high temperature silicone or something. But We'll just get it installed and go from there. Okay, so we got the frame all installed. You can see it here. This is where the vent will be. This is the channel lock for the wiggle wire. And then we unplug the greenhouse to let it deflate a little bit to make this easier. Now we're gonna run this wiggle wire through this channel. That'll seal off the plastic. Then we'll take a razor blade, cut this little square of plastic out and the vent will come out right here. So easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay, so we got the vent all done. That's all finished up. Now we just gotta get the gas line run out here. So let's get started on that.
Okay, gas line is all hooked up and finished. We got it all painted. It's looking good. It's hooked up to the heater. We are live up to the valve up there. And now we just gotta do the electrical. So we'll wire everything up, get the thermostat set up, and then the heater will be functioning. So everything is all wired now. The heater should be good to go. So we're gonna do the first startup and test run. So set the thermostat just to 100 degrees just to make sure it will for sure turn on. And then this light switch right here controls the heater. So we will turn this on. I can hear the fan turn on, so we must be doing something right. Now I gotta go turn on gas to it. Turn on our gas right here. And I'm gonna monkey my way back over here. And then we turn on the gas in the unit. Get lit, so let me see. I don't know if you can see in the video, but it's going. I think we're working here. You probably can't see me. I'm working a horrible job holding on. All right, it's working. We got hot air coming out. Awesome. The greenhouse is totally heated now. Super stoked about it. But we're gonna let this run for a while and just keep checking everything. I'm gonna check the temperature of the vent. Make sure it's not getting too hot for the greenhouse. And just make sure everything's working the way it should make sure the thermostat's working but yeah that is it so now we can get started on the pond and everything else